Automated customer support enhances the customer experience if it's done correctly. Much of the customer service process involves gathering information and or giving out advice that is already available on public FAQ sections. Automated customer support can do these tasks and so much more. Keep watching to find out more. Basic automation. Google is probably the biggest example of the most basic form of computer support. That is to have no customer support at all and have users rely on the massive knowledge base that it holds. For example, if you're using Google AdSense and your ads are not running, there's nobody you can contact. You have to search through the many FAQ sections and Google articles on the subject until you find a route to your solution. Autoresponders. Let's say you have a small business or have a small online enterprise. You're scaling up, so you decide to add a customer service department. Starting small probably means you offer customer support through dedicated email addresses and a widget that auto-sorts to the right category. Even this form of basic customer support can be automated with email autoresponders. Each email address has its own automated response that first tells the user the email has been received and then offers a series of solutions. For example, if the category was login issues, the automated email may offer the most common login issues and their solutions. Chatbot replies. Online chatbots are becoming more and more popular as they're a great way to collect basic info before a human customer support rep is free. When the human support worker enters the scenario, all the basic customer information has been gathered. The support worker reads through it and picks up on the conversation. Automated chatbots are also handy for weeding out users who are just using the chat function for merriment or to vent, like people who type in funny questions and those who type profanity into the online chat system because they're sick of the website's pop-ups. Basic phone automation. The whole press one for X, press two for Y is a very simple but effective form of telephone automation. Things are becoming more advanced with spoken passwords and speech recognition automation, but you can strike a happy balance between the simple and advanced stuff. For example, you can start with the press number options and once the user reaches the correct department or category, further details may be taken. Taking details such as date of birth and account number will help save the human customer support worker from having to ask for the information. This will save a lot of customer support time. So you should get yourself a cloud phone system today. We love JustCall.io as a phone system software. It allows us to automate all our call tracking, set up IVR menus, and call distribution rules with few clicks and it integrates with our CRM and help desk tools. It costs around 25 to 50 bucks per agent per month, which is nothing in comparison to the cost and time it saves and insane productivity boost that it brings. Diagnostic tools. Let's say you're upset that your website is not appearing on Bing. You look at their knowledge base, but you don't find an answer. When you try to get in touch with their customer service department, you are directed to Bing's diagnostic tools. You're not directed to a support worker. The Bing Webmaster tools will offer ways for you to figure out why your website is not appearing on the search engine results. As an added incentive to find the problem yourself, Bing will make you jump through many hoops before you ever gain access to a real human worker via their email support. The same concept can work for your business too. Customer service reps still serve an important role in a business's overall customer service plan. However, through the use of automated customer support, you can dramatically lower your human customer support's workload. For help automating your business, make sure to get in touch today. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe.